Hello, thanks for tuning in to the Boys and Girls Club of West Garbo's YouTube page. Welcome back to another edition of Five Fun Facts. This week we're going to talk about your Toronto Blue Jays, so let's play ball. Fact number one. The Blue Jays name came from a contest allowing fans to submit their ideas. The top choice was the Blues, but team management thought the Blue Jays sounded better. I think they made the right choice. Fact number two. The Blue Jays played their first game in 1977. During the game, there was a snowstorm. The Jays won the game and the fans went home happy, but a little chilly. Fact number three. Blue Jays fans love hot dogs. Each year, Jays fans eat enough hot dogs to cover the distance of 3,000 stolen bases. Baseball and hot dogs go hand in hand. Fact number four. In 1992, the Blue Jays won their first World Series championship. They were the first Canadian team to do it. They did it again in 1993, becoming back-to-back -back World Series champions thanks to a Joe Carter walk-off home run. Fact number five. The Blue Jays have three retired numbers. A retired number is a number that was worn by a great player and will ever be worn by another Blue Jay again. The first number is number 12. Number 12 was worn by Roberto Alomar. The second number is number 32. Number 32 was worn by Roy Halladay. The final number is number 42, and that was worn by Jackie Robinson. Jackie Robinson never played for the Blue Jays, but he was the first African American to play in Major League Baseball. Number 42 is retired by every Major League Baseball team. Bonus fact. This year, the Boys and Girls Club of West Scarborough has partnered with the Jays Care Foundation. We're going to offer an amazing virtual summer camp experience. Every day will be filled with fun activities, challenges, and a chance to connect with your friends. Check out the link below for registration information. Thanks very much for tuning in to another edition of 5 Fun Facts. We hope that you found this one interesting. Make sure you let us know if you've got ideas for future episodes. Thanks very much, and see you at camp.